Hi, in this lesson I'm going to demonstrate how to do the forward pass to determine early start, early late, and the duration of a project. So here we've got a network with uh, eight activities, and we begin with the first activity, and the early start is zero. Now I don't want to argue about how can a start time be zero. This is just how we work the problems. We always start with zero as the earliest start for the first activity. And since that activity is supposed to take two days, let's say, the earliest finish time is two days. Once that activity is done, then B and C can start. Those become the early start for B and C. The duration of B is one, so it's three. The duration of C is three, so it could be done on the fifth day. D can't start until both B and C are completed, so we choose five because that's when C is completed. Now, when you're going forward, one thing to keep in mind is always add and always choose the upper value. Here we had a choice between three or five. We choose the upper value or the highest value, that's five. Five plus one is six, and the start for E and F is six. Add two to six is eight, nine. G can start once E's done, which is 10. Now we have another choice, 10 or nine. Remember that we choose the higher number, and that's 10, and then 10 plus two is 12. So the earliest that this whole project can be completed, if we're talking in terms of days, is 12 days.